Hey guys, the chicken is here. We are back today with another Boom Beach video. In today's video, guys, I'm very excited because we are giving you a little sneak peek preview of the upcoming Boom Pass. This is going to include the new skins, all the rewards, and all of the missions. So if you guys haven't already, um, I appreciate it uh, right off the top. If you subscribe to the channel, we're closing in on 40k, which would be a real cool milestone for me to hit. And if you are going to get the Boom Pass, I do appreciate it if you throw that code chicken into the shop. So with that being said, Let's just do a quick scroll through here of the entire Boom Pass, then we'll show you all the skins. So, I believe a lot of these missions are going to be the same. Uh, it's nice to see that they seem to be incorporating more of the missions in with the warships as well, so regardless of how much you play the main base or warships, I know a lot of you are skewed either towards main base or skewed towards warships. Um, it's not 50-50, it's more the main base, which is fine. Um, but yeah, it's going to be more... It's uh, we're, we're seeing some more warship ones, cool. Uh, worship ones, uh, which is cool. So, destroy HQ last. I think we've seen all these. I don't know if we're going to actually see any new missions here, but we'll go ahead and collect every single one of them. Um, task Force Ops, destroy buildings, um, all these ones, since it's on the dev build, they are going to be uh, mysteries, so we can't uh, claim all of them, unfortunately. But, let's take a look through the Boom Pass here. So, first off, take a look at this skin, guys. This is the battleship. So these are called the Battleship and the Quintagon, okay? So as we scroll by through here, we're going to see some of the usual stuff. So Sculptor, Optimizer, um, Upgrade Optimizer, the, boom, the Build Optimizer. So all those are pretty much the same uh, that we would normally see throughout the Boom Pass, right? So nothing really changing there. Um, so yeah, let's just scroll on by and let's see here. Do, 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 do. Scrolling, scrolling, scrolling. So all the stuff is the same. And then I believe we'll get the uh, the Quintagon. Look at this. Look how sick this one is. So let's... Um, I don't know. Did I actually unlock them on here? This is on the dev build, so uh, I'm not sure. So yeah, we got to unlock these. So we'll unlock them, and let's take a look. Alrighty, there we go. So now that we've seen everything, let's go ahead and unlock all of this stuff, guys. So we're going to start off with the first skin, and this is called the... Uh, this is called the Battleship, I believe. It's uh, the Battleship and then the, the quintessential Quinticon. Um, so let's go ahead and unlock this one. And let's take a look here and see what it looks like on our crazy looking gunboat. Um, buildings? There it is. Yeah. Alright, so we're going to select that. Whoa! That's actually pretty cool. That's actually pretty cool. Now, I mean, if you if you don't like the skins, and they're not for you, you're not gonna like any of the skins, right? Now, for people that do like them, this is pretty cool. I wanna get that gold thing out of the way. This is pretty cool. Look at that. Look at that. And it goes with the theme too. I mean, the theme of Boom Beach being like a robot military game, um, it makes sense. It makes sense. It definitely looks like a higher level gunboat, kind of. So that's cool. Now let's skip back here. And let's collect all of these rewards, because with all the percentage boost, I believe it equals out to 20 or 25% by the end of the pass. So let's just see. So there's five on the lightning. Five on the, yeah, and they're typically all together, so we'll just count that as one. Build tokens galore. I always go with the, uh, with the red crystal and the attack plan. Um, I'm not going to be up unlocking this stuff optimally because obviously this is a dev build, so it doesn't matter. But I do want to show you guys just kind of quickly going through. So there's two. That brings us up to 10%. Yeah, I think you do get enough optimizers that it really does start to make a difference towards the end of the uh, um, towards the end of the seat, the pass. So let's see, let's see. And I'm interested to know in the comments, guys, what do you think about the warship seat? Oh, there's three. A pretty crazy uh, tech tree and stuff, eh? That was, uh, I, I'm not sure exactly. I, I still want to get you guys feedback for what you're planning for the day one path. Um, I'll probably, I'll put that video out tomorrow. This will just be about the pass and stuff today. Um, but yeah, very interested to see. There are a lot of options. The decks, the end are crazy. This is number four. So yeah, this will be 20%. And Attack plan, blueprints, there we go. Now we can get to, we'll finish this off first. I think that's it, right? 
Yeah. So 20% bonus on all the optimizers, then a bunch of free chests. But let's take a look at our brand new HQ. Heroic Industrial uh, Buildings. There we go. The Quintagon. And you don't have to switch these back. I mean, those, once you have it, you'll have it forever. Pretty cool. It kind of goes with the with the bunker, too. And the, well, not really the residences, because they're on those. But let's take a look at... Hmm. It actually looks kind of smaller, now that I look at it. But it looks cool. It looks cool. It might, you know... People are so used to saying, seeing the same looking stuff on everybody's bases that... Um, you know, I feel like it might kind of throw them off a little bit. They're just like, what the hell, you know? You know, what is that kind of thing? Um, I'm sure people will catch on fairly quickly that that is the HQ, but um, still pretty cool to see nonetheless. So I think out of the skins that we've seen so far, and I might be going out on a limb here, but I would say these are the best ones that we've seen um, to date because these ones are pretty cool. So, um, yeah. As of right now, we also have no update on the bug fixes. Um, no timeline, anyways. Maybe they came out, I'm making this video um, two days in advance, so maybe they've come out by now and uh, done an update, I don't know. Um, but I'm just hoping that none of this stuff is going to carry over into the warship season, especially with all the new things. Um, with the, um, well it's not a, really a new troop, the incinerator, but I'm hoping that that doesn't play a factor because that gets really annoying um, when that happens. You know, we had the three shock launcher bug last season, but I don't know about you guys. I didn't really experience that, like, at all. Um, I don't think I faced a single three shock launcher base, so, you know, I can't speak for everybody, obviously. But, um, yeah, if you're commenting on this video and you're about to say, like, hey, like, you know, my match pick is all messed up, um, they are going to fix that. I believe it's going to be fixed fairly soon. Um, if it's not fixed, like I said, by now already, um, you know. It's, uh, it's unfortunate, but it just kind of is what it is for right now. But, but don't worry. They know about it for sure, and they are working on these things. It was just kind of crazy because they came out with this update, uh, which really wasn't a massive update. I mean, I wouldn't go as far to say it was a nothing update. Like, they made some cool changes and stuff, but um, <laughs> the bugs that came out were definitely worse than anything that the update brought, which kind of sucks. Which kind of sucks, so... Um, I just want to talk about that because I know, you know, I'm going to get comments on it, uh, inevitably, so, um, so yeah, that's basically it for the video today, guys. I uh, just wanted to show you the new pass, the new skins. Um, it is kind of cool to get a little sneak preview on these things. And I really like the gunbow. I, I do. The, the HQ, I'm kind of, I think it looks good. I think it looks good, but I think the gunbow looks sick because it kind of catches your eye and you're just like, whoa, what is that? Um, but yeah. Both of those together, I think these are the, the best skins that we've seen so far in the game. So, I want to hear from you guys. What do you think? Um, do you care about the Boom Pass? Do you care about the skins? And um, anything else? Everything Boom Beach. Let me know. Down below in the comments. Oh, Floki's got a towel. <laughs> uh, I wish I could show you guys. It's so funny. He just looked at me so guilty. He's like, what? I wasn't chewing this the whole time. Um, so, appreciate you guys. Thanks for watching. We'll catch the next one. Checking out. Back, back.